This morning on the Health Watch, it's called the disease that turns people to, sc to stone. Scleroderma hardens tissue all over the body, and the fight is on to find better treatments. That disease is rare, striking about 50,000 Americans, mostly middle-aged women. Health reporter Stephanie Stahl has more. Just drinking water can be an ordeal for Kathy Griffin. She has scleroderma, a rare autoimmune disease that causes the skin and other organs to get thick and hard because the body generates too much collagen. I had a lot of um, surgeries for my situation. It's affected her heart and kidneys, and because of the narrowing of her esophagus, eating and drinking food is difficult. Kathy was diagnosed 23 years ago when she was 34. At the time, I was very upset because there's no cure for it. They said that a lot of people with scleroderma don't live long in life. But with medications and taking care of herself, Kathy is surviving as her appearance continues to change with the hardening of her skin. I was losing my hair at this time. She eventually lost all of her hair and now wears a wig as a volunteer working with the Scleroderma Foundation to raise awareness and money for research. Did you see your new volunteer shirt? Here they're getting ready for a walk in York, and Kathy is competing in the Mrs. New Jersey America pageant. I'm Mrs. Camden County, um, and I'm going for Mrs. New Jersey America. That is I'm very, ner very nervous and very excited. The pageant happens in May next year. In addition to evening gown and swimsuit presentations, there will be interviews where Kathy hopes to talk more about scleroderma. I always wanted to do something for the disease. And I figured this would be the best platform. It's not known what causes scleroderma. Cases can be mild to severe. It is hoped that with more money for research, they can find a better treatment. I'm Stephanie Stahl, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.